What's up, Two Wheel Turban? Today we're back in the Cybertruck for the second video on the channel. Uh, we did the delivery video in the last one. Somehow did super good. If you haven't checked that out, go check out that last video. You really get to see what the process is like picking up one of these Cybertrucks. Uh, pretty cool experience, very different than anything like, say you go to a Toyota dealer, a Ford dealer, and the process of you know buying a car like that. It's way more painstaking, you know, going to a typical brand. Tesla makes it really easy. Everything's pretty much done online. There aren't any markups, anything like that. You just show up and you go pick up your car. They give you a few, you know, some information if you have any questions on it. And you just drive away. It's super simple. And you should check that video out if you haven't. But for today's video, we're doing a realistic 0-60 to 60 time on this dual motor foundation series Cybertruck. Uh, I'm super excited because these things supposedly move pretty quick, but we're going to find out truly how quick it goes from 0 to 60. I don't want to listen to what some of these, uh, you know, magazines, all these different uh, reporters say that this car is 0 to 60. Let's go out on the real road, not a drag strip, you know, not a really like controlled environment. And we're going to see what it's like. Say you come to a stoplight, you're up against that 911 or that Mustang 5.0, how are you gonna do in your Cybertruck? Are you gonna be able to beat them to 60? Well, today we're gonna find out. All right, to see what this Cybertruck can go from zero to 60, we wanna make sure we're not in uh, like a comfort setting or some off-road setting. We're gonna make sure that we are in sport mode where um, we have more focused ride and handling, the ride height's lower. And for acceleration, it says standard. I wanna see if we can, uh, Okay, so there's chill and standard. So standard, I'm assuming, is the quickest. Ride and handling, we want to be in focused. And we're going to be in a lower ride mode when we go back to sport. And let's see if any of these are important. Nope. So let's just make sure we're in the fastest setting, which is sport, as you guys can see. And we're going to go do three runs and average those three runs and see what this Cybertruck goes from 0 to 60. All right, guys, we're on our way on the Cybertruck. And... Um, if you guys can get this video to 100 likes, we'll do a realistic quarter mile time and see what this truck can do in a quarter mile. How's it gonna do? Man, it's busy out here. We'll see how this thing does. See what the conditions are. This is just normal, you know, normal like concrete, no drag prep, nothing like that. So, really gonna get a good idea of how this truck accelerates from 60 uh, in this position. We're gonna get ourselves to a nice position. All right, we'll come to zero. Let's see. I think we're at zero and we'll get ready to go. It's brutal. Brutal. Wow. Whew. Dude, I cannot imagine what the Cyber Beast is like. I've been in fast cars, I've been in faster cars than this. My buddy's thousand horsepower, uh, oh geez, thousand horsepower Whipple Mustang. And uh, you know, but something about EV acceleration is just completely different. Uh, I don't know, gas cars really, they're just not similar in any way because just the amount of torque you have on hand instantly is unreal and it just surprises me every single time. I don't know what time we did there. I'm gonna go back to my editing software, bring it down to you know, like the hundredth of a second so we really understand what it's doing. Um, let's turn around here and uh, we'll get another run in and see what the Cybertruck is doing on this second run, zero to 60. And this is miles an hour, just in case we got any foreign viewers. We're not doing no kilometers an hour out here. Um, I don't even think this truck's allowed in any places with kilometers an hour. So we're just going to line up here, come back to a stop, make sure we're at zero, get that video on, and uh, get ready to punch it. Ready, set, go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. It feels quick. I have a, I personally have Mark V uh, Toyota Supra BMW, um, and my car definitely does not launch anything like this. It's rear wheel drive. This thing just gets crazy traction. I don't even think I heard the tire spin. And you know, my Supra, that thing, <laughs> it's tires spin all the time. So <sighs> let's see what we can get in this third run. I'm just gonna drive up here and uh, get ourselves in a good spot. Oh, 
But what do you guys think? Do you think a vehicle weighing almost 7,000 pounds with this type of zero to 60 time with crazy angles, I mean, is it too dangerous for the streets or is this what America is all about, having crazy vehicles like this on the road? Let me know down below. I'm curious to hear your opinion. Uh, is this Cybertruck completely ridiculous and should not be on public roads or are you all for it? Let me know in the comments below. All right, here we go. We're at zero. Ready, guys? And go. Nice. Whew. <laughs> okay, and I have the AC off, just in case you guys don't know. I'm trying to see, you know, how quick it can go. I don't know if AC really pulls that much power, but let's turn that back on because I am starting to sweat real bad. I mean, if I had to say, I would say it's around four-ish seconds, you know? Um, it definitely has to be faster than five. There's no way this thing's doing a five-second zero to 60, this dual motor. I think the base Cybertruck, uh, I don't really recall exactly what it does, but I think it was somewhere in the fives. Um, definitely slower than this, because I think this one puts out like 600 horsepower, um, however they rate these, these motors. and you know, in combination of what this, the battery pack has. Um, but it's definitely quick. You, I mean, you're moving 7,000 pounds down the road. You're getting it from a complete standstill up to 60 miles an hour in just a few seconds. And, and when you consider the Cyber Beast that has like a thousand horsepower, um, pretty unreal that that thing I think can do zero to 60 in like three seconds flat, which is, you know, faster than, you know, just as fast as like Lambos, Ferraris, and you're moving, like I said, 7,000 pounds, you know, probably double the weight of a lot of these sports cars that um, are purposely designed to go fast. So pretty amazing. Now you definitely miss out on the sound, like say you get into a supercharged uh, F-150 and you're going from a dig, and even if you're going to slower zero to 60 time, you're probably gonna have a bigger smile on your face than going quicker in a cyber truck. Cause I mean, anyone can hop in on this and just, you know, you're just like being a monkey, you just mash the pedal and it doesn't really take any skill. But you know, gas cars, especially with manual and stuff, there's a lot of, you know, clutch timing, um, how much power you're really putting on the throttle to prevent wheel spin uh, in a rear wheel. Oh, wow, that's cool. It notified me that the light turned green. But so, um, you know, I think those are really good runs. I'm excited to go run inside and see what uh, they were and what the averages were. But it's definitely quick, definitely quick truck, no doubt about that. But, um, but at this point, I've probably already put those numbers up in the video. So you guys already know what it did, zero to 60. Let me know if you guys are impressed down below. And uh, I want you guys to stay tuned for more videos. Get this video to 100 likes. We'll do a quarter mile, what it does realistically. Just average person, non-race car driver out here. What's it gonna do in a quarter mile? Stay tuned, probably gonna put this car up against uh, you know, my Supra, see how it does. Maybe against some Mustangs. We'll see how the Cybertruck does. I want you guys to stay tuned going to be bringing out a lot more cyber truck content as well as motorcycle content so hit that subscribe button and uh, we'll get some sweet content coming out here soon catch you in the next one